Hello, this is Nick with nickscomputerfix.com and here's a video on some of the new features within Windows 10's update for spring of 2019. And the first one that I like to talk about is the new light blue default background or wallpaper. It has changed from a dark blue to a lighter blue and looks a little bit different. And if we go into personalization for the wallpaper, we can see that the old default wallpaper from the previous Windows 10 version is no longer included but some of the older wallpapers that were in the previous Windows 10 version are included. Okay the next new feature change within Windows 10's update is the search function and Cortana are now separated. If we go down to the taskbar and click on the search command line we have no Cortana and if we click over here Cortana does come up which is a great new feature that I am really happy about. Okay up next in the action center they've added some new items so let's go down to our taskbar here in the right hand corner of the screen and click on the action center icon and that allows us to see the new items which have been added into the action center here and the first one is nearby sharing it's an on and off button and that is connected with your Bluetooth so once you click on the new Bluetooth button and make a connection with another Bluetooth device you can share um, information data and music with nearby devices okay um, the last one here is the brightness control they've made it really simple and easy to adjust the display brightness on any laptop or tablet device and uh, this is my favorite new feature that has been added to the Windows update for this version of Windows 10. Um, I love it. Okay up next there's been a new keyboard shortcut that's been added to access the snip and sketch very quickly and that is the win key plus shift plus s and let me open up uh, file explorer here and go ahead and press the win key plus shift plus s and that brings up the toolbar up here and we can do a rectangular snip a free form a window snip and we can also do a full screen snip and that makes it very easy and convenient and quick to do that and remember this gets placed in the clipboard um, the memory on your PC so that you can paste it into any um, graphics editor that you choose like paint okay um, the next update is two noteworthy changes in Windows settings and let's go ahead and go down to um, Oh, no. we'll go down to the start menu here and uh, click on the icon for settings and that opens up the window settings and the new category which has been added is search and we'll go ahead and click on that which brings up a window where we can put in place new filters that filters out adult content and um, this is a really good feature especially if you have a single laptop or computer that's being used by multiple people within your family um, or within a house or business. Okay, um, the next item, let's go back to um, our home here and the next item that I want to point out is update and security. The category is the same but they made some changes within the Windows update and security features and as you can see first off we can pause the updates for seven days we can change the um, hours the active hours view update history and we have advanced options down below and when you go ahead and make a change on you know pausing the updates for seven days you can make these changes and alter them a little bit um, within advanced options all right um, that is a really cool feature sometimes you don't want those updates to happen um, because you're in the middle of a project or you're doing something like um, video editing like I am um, and you don't want to be interrupted okay um, the next feature is emoji 
uh, keyboard shortcut and more emojis all right and the keyboard shortcut that I'm talking about is the win key and the period key and when you press it um, it immediately brings up the emoji window and as you can see there are three new categories or two new categories actually um, that you can select new um, symbols from and these two are really cool and I like this last one the Greek one Greek symbols and it makes it really easy to access uh, symbols that I like to use in certain um, cases and of course my favorite um, emoji is the um, smile and face with uh, sunglasses and I always use that a lot and of course the like button on the left too okay we have come to the end of this video I hope it was helpful be sure to click on the subscribe button down here in the lower right hand corner and please leave a like if you like